Question number one. Why do you do this, Krivos? Why are you making old school runescape videos? Well, firstly, because sometimes I want to get few E's out of you guys. And if I'm feeling extra spicy, we might even get few ahas because my brain is similar to what a 14 year old would feel. Anxiety and hormones and secondly, sometimes I wonder how far I can take my videos before I get a call from Jagex saying Grievous, you can't just put out offensive content with our assets. That doesn't work anymore, we need you to take it down. And I'm like, yes Papa Jagex, sorry for crossing the line. But so far, I don't know what the line is, so I'm gonna keep pushing it until I find out and then stay just slightly under that until the rest of my life. And that's my plan. Will my videos get demonetized? <laughs> yes, yes, yes they will. Is it funny? Yes, yes, yes it is. Am I gonna regret this? Probably, yeah, but hey, sometimes you're the windshield, sometimes you're the bug. That's just how life goes. Now, this is my way of thinking about YouTube. Yours could be different, but let's try to find out what that is. First things first, I want to talk about one hit wonders. I had that, and surprisingly, I only had one. I guess that's why they call it this way. In any case, when I uploaded my chicken video, I had 3000 subscribers. That video got over 250,000 views. Now, to a normal person, that makes no sense. I'm not normal, and it didn't make sense to me either. How? Why? What is this witchcraft and how can I replicate it? And trust me, if I had answers to how I got that, I would use it over and over again. But to this day, I have no idea how that happened. The problem with that was, I desperately tried to recreate that one hit success and that led me down a rabbit hole that I wish I didn't go to. Yes, I had some more mild success where I posted the same idea and now I got 30,000 views but it just kind of left me scratching my head, thinking what is going on? Am I really gonna be one hit wonder and boil into darkness or am I just gonna chill and make stuff that I find funny? I'm really glad I changed my perspective and now starting to realize that consistency is so much more important than fighting that one single golden coin. I managed to make a nice cozy community on Discord with my admins where we have over 200 lovely old school RuneScape players and weekly events happening all the time for everyone to enjoy. I managed to piss off YouTube for making an OnlyFans video that to this day I still think is my greatest achievement and I managed to meet some other very amazing content creators that have helped me so much on everything about this super interesting yet scary world called YouTube. And throughout all that, I still 9 months later have lost zero interest in quitting YouTube. In fact, it's the exact opposite where more than anything I want to do YouTube is right now. I want to upload this video and start working on another one. You know, after a long grind you finally get that drop and the dopamine rush kicks in. That's me, but whenever I upload a video, it's amazing and I love it. I started my Twitch channel where we do stupid things and come up with stupid ideas. I have so many ideas I want to bring to life. You have no idea. I have new funny videos, new Iron Man series, new OnlyFans. Well, probably not that anymore since YouTube did say if I post one more OnlyFans video, they will not allow me to post any more videos. LOL. Almost got banned for one stupid joke. Classic me. And I have this idea where I want to do the biggest drop party in the history of old school RuneScape. And if that isn't ambitious, I don't know what is. Probably not gonna work out, but hey, a man can dream. But yeah, I want to keep this going and to do that, I need consistency. So I guess to round up point number one, don't chase your one hit wonders like I did. Instead, work on consistent workflow, schedules and really think this through. Because I have many players come up to me already and ask for advice on how to start YouTube and I only tell them one question. Do we really want to do this? Because the norm these days usually is that you have to do this for at least a year before you get any rewards for your work. And the eternal question is, will I be enjoying this in one year, in two years, five years, in the future as well? If the answer is yes, go crazy. Because for me, the year 2022 has been literally like yeah, I could go touch grass outside, but I could also make AHA RuneScape videos and jerk off. It's honestly debatable, and so far the second choice is the clear winner here. Before we get to point number two, let's make one thing very clear here. I'm not always right, but I'm never wrong, okay? Glad we got that sorted out. Point number two. My biggest critical point was that I always overthought everything. What I wanna do, how my videos are gonna go, is that funny, is that offensive, should I focus on more on the story or the visuals, I overthought everything. It's like wearing protection before you even go on a date. 
you don't have to do that. It's not like you're gonna get laid anyways. Now I'm slowly starting to realize that things usually have a way to figure themselves out and it's quite literally impossible to predict how your next video is gonna go. That's the volatile space of YouTube environment. Like you could see here, I posted a video and it got over 20,000 views and the next one I posted got 2,000 views. It depends highly on the topics you cover, the titles, the thumbnails you use, how trending you are and what's the core audience think of this. The people that no matter what will always click on your videos. As my chemical romance put it, teenagers scare the living shit out of me but change teenagers with YouTube and you get what I mean. So if you're not ready for that, I don't recommend this part but other than that, GLHF man, GLHF. And for third and final point, oh my god. Oh my god, my schedule is godlike. Wake up whenever I want, go to sleep whenever I want, I don't have to worry about alarms, hello, no Monday to Friday work weeks, no boss that yells at you, oh my god, oh my god. And if you're thinking Creepus, that is weird flex. You're right, that is a weird flex, but I felt like I had to leave that little nugget in. Sorry, not sorry. Remember when we were kids and we dreamed of this when we were grown up? This is my dream coming through right now. The reality is though, this is super weird to me. Like how do you explain to someone, let's say you go on a first date, let's say you meet new people, let's say you talk to a stranger in bus station and you ask them, hey, what do you do for a living? And they say, you know, I work in inventory management, I work as a dentist, I work in customer service, I have an office job and what do you do, Grievous? I, um, I play 20 year old MMO for a living. <laughs> <laughs> like don't get me wrong, don't get me wrong, I'm not ashamed of this, it's actually the opposite. I'm really starting to flex this shit more often now. Bam, you work really hard for 6 years to get education and work your way up the ladder. Well, I just completed rates 3 on expert difficulty. Okay, okay, this video is getting off rails, let's just start ending this. My point is, I have so much more to learn and I have learned so much already. The world of YouTube and RuneScape is truly one of a kind and I'm glad I'm in it for the right. Oh, and by the way, if you really, really enjoy me suffering, here is a small clip for you to satisfy your needs. Mita! Mita! Päriselt ka, Päriselt ka, balloon, ei! Stop hitting me with the scum! Oh my god, no, please. What is going on? Is this actually happening right now? Is this the world we live in? Oh my god, what the hell, man? No, 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 I have to restart now. Yup, yup, yup. Enjoy that. If you got a bonus for that, I don't blame you. In the 9 months I've done YouTube, I've almost hit 10,000 subscribers. Still a little bit of a way to go, please help me get that. I have almost 1 million views on this channel. Still a little bit of a way to go, please help me get that. <laughs> and now, this will be my 100th video posted. Kind of poetic in a sense. 10,000 subscribers, 1 million views, 100 videos. I wish I could make like a catch line here, but we'll leave it at that. Hey, I made 100 videos, here's to another 100. I love you so much and you mean the world to me. Have a nice day. Mwah.